with our Charbroil 3-in-1. And of course, you know Mark's been uh, with us doing this for a long, long time. We love this product. You know, when you, when you think about summertime, yeah. We love to think about barbecue. We're Canadian. Uh, Year-round. Totally. <laughs> well, well, you know what? And you know me, I'll, I will shovel I a path to get yep. to the grill outside. We know you will as well. This is our now famous customer pick, Charbroil True Infrared 3-in-1 Roaster Smoker and Grill. By the way, if you own this, we'd love to hear from you. We're going to put our testimonial line up. This thing is truly one of a kind. Anybody that uh, wants to have fun in the sun and, and wants to enjoy summertime fun, in addition to fall and winter and, and springtime barbecue, you can do it once you have this machine. Let me just tell you quickly, it is true in infrared one click of a button and you are on your way there's virtually nothing you can't cook uh, we're going to do deep fried turkeys we're going to do burgers we're going to show you dogs steaks roasts <laughs> ribs veggies you can do it all it is an amazing product and let me quickly before Mark gets started because once he goes like you can't catch him uh, <laughs> it is $80 off if you buy it wow. today so it's normally $249 it's $169.95 we're taking another $25.95 off that's over $105 off of this grill if you want to write, have, buy it right now, and you're going to have it for years and years and years, it's also on FlexPay. $33.99. You know, it's all got started with that dang deep-fried turkey. That's how it Everybody all likes deep-fried turkey. You know, it's, uh, grilling's all about getting together with family, getting together with friends. So welcome to our house, friends. Let's do some grilling. And we're going to start with what I got to say is one of the holy grails of outdoor cooking and, and, and barbecuing and grilling. And that's this, my friends. Check this out. The deep-fried turkey. If you've ever had it, boy, oh boy, you know what I'm talking about when I talk about how good this is. If you've never had it, I'm going to show you a better way than to have to pull this out of a pot of oil. So, Guy, here's what I'm going to do. Yeah, buddy. I always say never, ever, 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 ever cut into meat unless you've given it a chance to rest. So I'm going to set this right here. Okay. And then I'm going to show everybody how we got there. Now, normally, if you're going to deep fry a turkey, well, there we go. Normally, if you're going to deep fry a turkey, you got to go and you got to find yourself one of these. That's about three gallons of peanut oil, you guys. It's like 60 bucks. The turkey was 20. Do the math. It doesn't even make any sense. Sense. Plus, you go ahead and you do an oil-based turkey fry over an open flame, you know, half the time you need a fireman the next morning. <laughs> Let's be honest Exactly. Here. This is what sets everything apart, guys. The name on the top of this is Charbroil. It's one of the best names in outdoor cooking. Powder-coated steel. This is designed to last you years and years and years. It's nice and light. Don't let the size fool you, you guys. We put silicone uh, grips on the handle so you can move this around. Take it tailgating. Have some fun with it. You know what? Take the party with you. Now, as you follow me down here, this is one of these pieces of equipment where you're like, holy moly, am I going to be able to figure this out? Look at this, you guys. There's two buttons. There's more buttons on a hairdryer. All you do is you turn it on and you give it a click. Now, as soon as you do that, after, by the way, hooking it up to the regular 20-gallon propane tank you already have in the backyard, right. you're going to engage three separate cooking technologies. Number one is conventional heat. That's the transfer of hot air, just like in your oven, from the air to the surface of the food. That's what starts the browning. You've got radiant heat. Do you love those rotisserie chickens you get at the store? That's radiant heat. And the secret, the real secret, is Charbroil's patented true infrared cooking technology, you guys. That's the way that we can take the flame that the propane generates and use that heat in a much more directed, concentrated way. That's gonna give you those great deep fried results when it comes to the turkey, like you would get if you bathed it in oil, not to mention the grilling and the smoking that we're gonna do. So I'll tell you what, here we go. We've got our turkey. You can go up to a 26 pound bird, you guys. You're gonna feed uh, an army with this or you're gonna feed a family for a week with it. Now, Guy's gone ahead and seasoned this up for us. And if you've ever deep fried a turkey, you might be looking at this going, well, hold on a second. If you're gonna deep fry a turkey, you can't put the salt in the pepper. You're gonna lose the gravy. You right. can't do the oil. You gotta remember, when I say oil is, I don't mean some oil, I don't mean a little oil. I mean no oil at all. So all you do is you get your bird ready. It's a basket system, so you can either do it in the kitchen or walk it out to the backyard. That's it. And guys, seriously, that's it. Now, if this was an oil-based turkey fryer, I would spend the next three hours at my party like this, <laughs> hoping that it doesn't <laughs> boil over. We've all seen the news the day after Thanksgiving, Easter, when that's gone wrong. Guys, a couple of hours later, no basting, no babysitting, no worrying, no nothing. This is what you're going to end up with. Now, let me just go ahead and take that out of there. And guys, wait till you see this. It's unbelievable. You're looking at the presentation, the demonstration that made the Big Easy famous here at the network. And I'm going to show you why in just a second. But first, I need everybody in the studio just because this you got a year. Oh, oh boy. If you see that, <laughs> not, coming not close. That, but the juice Look, is coming close. You have to see that shot. <laughs> I see that again, the, Mark. I was going for the sound of the skin, that turkey bake. I mean, you can see the juices just fly out. So, guys, ready? Pop. 
Boy, howdy, that's what it's all about. The juices, the tenderness, that taste, flavor, and texture of a deep fried turkey. But look at this, without the oil, without the grease, with all the extra fat, calories, cholesterol, everything that you don't want, it's right here. And guys, you look, out look at a drip, you, buddy. look at a drip here. Now, guy, I know you've had your share of deep fried turkeys. Oh yeah. And I always, always, always love to challenge my hosts when I work with them. I double dog dip Daria to tell me that this is any different than that turkey yeah. that you soak in oil and, and have to clean and worry about. And that's unbelievable. Isn't it? It's, it's just so, melts. It's so juicy. <laughs> I love it. And you know, mm. anybody that's had a dried bird before, they'll never be like that mm. again. It's, no, it's the again. way it sears it in. You know, it's the same stuff mm. that you love about those rotisserie mm. chickens that you get, because mm -hmm. they're seared on the outside. They use that wonderful cooking. Look at the juice you that's coming juicy? out of that turkey. There's juicy. That's what I'm talking Un about. Unfreaking <laughs> believable. We actually had to buy special uh, cutting boards with yeah, coats. With deeper. The, right, because yeah. the cutting boards we had here, we were making a mess all over the table. That's the kind of results that you're going to get every, every time. single time. Yep. Now, if this was three, four, five years ago, we kind of be done. This this is what the Big Easy did. It did big cuts of meat, mm. big turkeys, big beef, big lamb, big this, big that. But you know what? At Charboil, we took a step back and we're like, okay, how can we make this grilling experience, this backdoor living experience, this friend gathering experience, the best that it can be for everybody? So here's the first thing that we did, you guys. Everybody, it's not an extra cost, everybody is gonna get one of these. This is called a grill emitter plate. What this is gonna do is this is gonna turn your big roaster, the Big Easy, into a 185 square inch full infrared grill. Guys, have you ever gone and shopped for an infrared wow. grill? It's usually like a little part off to the side right. that super sears or creates a lot of heat and then the rest of it's just a regular grill. That's not what we're doing here, you guys. Every square inch is infrared. Now, one of the things I wanna show you before I start pulling off any food here, this is really neat. The way this machine works, when you turn that propane on, when you fire it up, there isn't a bunch of flame and fire under the food. That's where the flares come up, the fire up, right. the hairdos like mine that you don't want. The fire is all contained, the heat is all contained in the outside cylinder and that's what creates the infrared cooking. So when I take even oil, and pour it right in the middle of my charbroil three in one, there's no, no smoke, there's no right. fire, there's no flame, there's no nothing, and that's what we're looking for. So guys, with the Olympics in full swing, and what football's coming up, baseball, the whole nine yards, yeah. next time you have a, you know the big party, here's what I want you to do. You love wings, forget that freezer stuff, forget the stuff that costs you a fortune at the bar. All you're gonna do, put your grill on about medium, put those wings on on about eight minutes each side, oh, yeah. and you have the best darn grilled wings that you've ever had in your life. You'll never have wings another way after you have it on the charbroil when you use the infrared cooking Look at technology. That. So I'm gonna right. that there. $33.99 to get this home. It is $80 off plus free shipping. Never had a better opportunity to grab it than right now. And it's not too late. I mean, heck, we're only in August. You're gonna have months and months of cooking on this. I, I like I said, my family, my brothers and I, we, we cook all the way through the holidays. We don't right. care if it's snowing outside. <laughs> exactly. you'll, you'll do it. And all you need is your propane tank. You hook it up and you're good to go. You, hit, you, to you go. snap one button. I think I had a Mark's going to show you lots life. of great different things you can, that you can make here. <laughs> Obviously, you know, it's a little bit rainy yeah. outside, so we brought everything inside right. today. But uh, you want to have these. You cook outside with these. You're going to have the best results every time. Now, here's one of the things that I love about our grill plate. You know what? A lot of people like veggies. They like smaller foods. They like shrimp. And then you have to go and you have to go into buying special mats and grill and baskets. Look at this, you guys. The smallest shrimp, the smallest vegetables are not gonna fall through this grill plate. That's one of the things that I love about it. We've thought of everything to make this experience for you as good as it can possibly be. So I'm gonna take my shrimp. I'm just gonna add them up over there, just like that, and follow me to the back here. And let me show you the results that you're gonna get. So many times people see the barbecuing shows, the grilling shows, right. and they're like, man, that stuff looks good. But how do I end up doing it at home? You know, you can follow the recipes, but for some reason, it never looks quite right. It's the tools and it's the equipment. Charbroil is gonna give you the tools and the equipment to get these results. Can you mm -hmm. pass me a knife, brother? Yes, In buddy. the easiest way possible. So let's start with that steak. You know, the, it, when people think grilling, they think steaks. And I'll tell you something, I don't care what five-star restaurant you go to, if you are looking for that medium-rare steak, boy, that is it. And I'm telling you, watch this, the weight of the knife is what falls through this steak. That's one of the things that I love. Those are the kind of results that you're gonna get. Beautiful. So let me take the steak and set it right here, just I like, like that. Steak. Now we're gonna really get into some fun. All right. I'm gonna show you a really neat thing to try when you get your grill at home. 
I want you to take a pineapple, cut off the top and the bottom, okay? So now you're gonna take it and you're gonna uh, cut it into four pieces mm -hmm. from top to bottom. And then you're simply gonna cut out the flesh of the pineapple. Put that away for a snack, put it on the grill, whatever you want. But look at this, you're gonna end up with two sides of the skin. Now this is normally something you'd throw out. Here's what I want you to do with it. I want you to go ahead, take two of them, Mm -hmm. and put a gorgeous piece of salmon, whitefish, cod, tilapia, whatever you want, right in the middle. It's called cedar plank salmon. And let me tell you something, just like the fat cap on a brisket yeah. renders all of its taste and flavor into the meat below, the pineapple renders all of its taste and flavor into the flesh of the I don't think you really need salmon. a knife. Look at this. No, you really don't. <laughs> Look, Look what's beautiful. happening here, you guys. And, guy. and it, has the essence of, it has the essence of pineapple inside it's, there. It's all the way through. Yeah, it's beautiful. Thank you, buddy. You're going to love, love, love this. Oh, my God, so good. <laughs> nice. Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> or pineapple, mm. our, our salmon loves that kind of it really flavor does anyway. sweetness and acidity. Mm. It's so good. A little towel here. And it's mild and it's flaky. It's absolutely delicious. Just scratching the surface. We need to see what else he's done. Oh boy, this, yeah. this, this, this is gives you an idea of some of the creative things you can do have with it. Have a good time with yeah. this. And the fact that you have complete control over the heat, the intensity, the way that yep. that true infrared technology works, the same technology the five-star chefs all over the world use, it means that you can try these inventive little dishes and really get the results you're looking for. Now you're looking at this going, what, what is he doing there? Wouldn't you love, next time you have everybody over, to have a bacon-wrapped, ooey gooey, you gotta be kidding me, grilled cheese sandwich guy. Now I'm gonna give delicious. you one of these, because I haven't had breakfast yet. Yeah, these Cheers, are all my good. friend. I know, mm. these are delicious. <laughs> oh my God. Then you have bacon on the outside, and you got cheese wow. on the inside. <laughs> you can't, I know, you can't do much better than that. Need a napkin it. with that one. Mm -hmm. Let me remind you, where's my cookbook? Mm. I mm -hmm. wanna show everybody really quick while well, Mark's Clean it up and finishing chewing. <laughs> um, if you would like to get, we have Everybody Grills, which comes to you from Charbroil. Uh, this is the actual cookbook that these guys manufacture. 200 recipes inside here. It's one of the best cookbooks I've ever seen. I have this one at home. Um, the, re the recipes are fantastic, all uh, suitable for your grill. Uh, whether you cook on it, in it, however you want to do it, there's great recipes inside here. There's a picture on every single page of this book. Look at this. Uh, this is only $24.95. Everybody that gets a grill always gets one of these. Absolutely. You won't believe if you like spare ribs and things like that, by the way, um, we, we'll keep the item number uh, available for you at the bottom of the screen if you want to get that. We'll talk more about that in just a sec. If you love, if you're eating um, the high protein diets and you're trying to stay away from carbs, well, you probably get tired of ordinary baked chicken. Um, when you grill a chicken breast and marinate it, you know, you get that great flavor. You, you still, you keep the carbs down Absolutely. And, and you get the most amazing flavor. So if you like Caesar salads and stuff like that. If you, you don't even have to be a meat eater. You can be a vegetarian. There's not, I mean, vegetarians do not want to eat steamed vegetables every day. Mm -mm -mm. They want their vegetables roasted. They want them grilled. They want to add that flavor, that flavor that smoke imparts and, and char grilling imparts, and you have that. We have not even gotten to my favorite part of this, which is the smoking part, <laughs> because right. this is also a smoker. A lot of people will go out and they'll buy, they'll buy, uh, you know, a roaster oven. They'll buy a grill oven, right. uh, and then they'll also go and buy a separate smoker. You got all these appliances all over. There's no place to put them. Right. This houses everything in one unit. So when you want to do smoked ribs, when you want to do barbecue, which we're going to get to, you can do that. But the amount of food, because it's, it's incredible. huge, this is designed amazing. for one person to make a burger with, or for you to invite everybody you've ever yep. met your whole life and feed them in one sitting, guys. Watch what I'm going to do here, okay? I love this. Because of the way, <coughs> because of the way the technology works, you are opening the door to some experiences that you've never wow, been able to do at this. home. And remember, everything is coming with the machine that you need. So, guys, that basket, how about loading it up with 15, 20, 25, 30, 35 pounds of the best seafood and clam bake, Amazing. or Louisiana low boil, or whatever kind of food it is you love that you want to serve, you know, the whole uh, friends and family here. Now, by the way, this little handle here that I've taken, that I'm using to take the baskets out, this is included. It's multi-use. I'm going to show you a couple of things you can do with it, but that's how you get the basket out of the machine. So I'm going to set it right there. Now let's see what we got here. I, I love your this bag of man. seafood. Any excuse that I have to get people together to hear those wows, to hear that yum yum come out when they have that yeah, first bite, that. man, I'm all over it. So check this out. So 15 pounds crawfish, shrimp, shrimp and crawfish. Yeah, look at that. And then hiding up underneath. By the way, you might. Oh well, these potatoes are gonna roll. Watch out. It's <laughs> all right. There we go. Whatever you can stuff in the basket. We got some sausage in there fit too. The machine, some sausage, some corn. Now I'm gonna walk this out so you can really get the size of it. But before before I do, dress it up a little let's bit. Let's hit it with garlic a little bit. Garlic bread. A little garlic bread. We're going to give it a little bit 
of seasoning there with the and some lemon yeah and a little bit of lemon there so guy here's what i'm gonna now do you take this and put it on a table full with just newspaper that's oh, all boy. you do check this out Go guys ahead. let me wander over this i'm gonna Feel venture free. to say that the money it cost us to do this one presentation is probably less than the machines worth <laughs> i gotta tell you you guys yeah the value on this is incredible. The versatility is unbelievable. And we've called it the three in one. We've only hit two. Exactly. Yeah, you, you probably, realistically, you probably have $200 worth of seafood Woo! right there. Boy, that's good. And only $169. It's $80 off on price break. If you've always wanted to have your own barbecue, you know, there's a lot of barbecue shows on TV. Right. We're all addicted to them. There's, yeah. I mean, there's, there's more barbecue than any other type of food show exactly. based in TV. There's a reason. The cooking shows because people are crazy about it. First of all, what's nice about barbecue is, um, you know, it's not deep fried food. You, you, a lot of people will love it who are on high protein diets. Um, grilling imparts a great flavor. Uh, you can be very creative with grilling as well. Uh, that's why it's so popular on TV, but it, a lot of people think they can't do it at home. All you need is the right system. The number one thing that great barbecue chefs have is they have a great way to cook their food. That's what it's all about. It's some seasoning in, involved, but some of the best chefs, uh, chefs out there, you know what they use on their barbecue? Salt and pepper. That's it. They don't put a bunch of other stuff. They don't have to inject it. You can if you want. That's the fun part. <clears throat> but but this is a blast. And, and you get to do so many different things. And one of the things I love, love, love about this is the fact that we also get to do... Are you going to put butter on? I have a little bit of forgot the about the butter on his... On his yeah. <laughs> Heaven forbid we don't add the butter you on top of it. You cannot have the butter. What's the point? Um, but one of the most fun things you'll be able to do with this, and it allows you really to kind of kick it up a notch, is when you add the smoking feature. Exactly. And that's... And that's, that's, that's really where it kicks up you know you talked about it it's your favorite part it's my yeah. favorite part and it's such an elusive method of cooking because traditionally you need to have giant pieces of equipment you need to have knowledge about fire and accelerant you got to have 13 or 14 hours of time on your hands well we've solved that for you you guys the same machine that's going to do those giant roasts the same machine that's going to do sure. that grill watch this you guys every machine now comes with a smoker box so you're going to take your favorite wood chips your alder your mesquite, your hickory, mm -hmm. your cherry, your apple. In fact, there's some great ones available here from Charbroil. And you're going to load those chips up in there. And we've designed a system where you don't have to go and soak these. It's ready to go. You pop it in the side, put the temperature on low. And now, my friend, you yeah. are smoking. You're that smell that everybody has in the neighborhood. You're the one that people want to go to. You're the ones that are going, when is he having a cookout again? So here's what I'm going to do. I got some fun stuff I'm going to make behind it. So I'm going to take a minute. I'm going to unload these two machines. And I want you to really watch what's coming out of here and start thinking of, of your own ideas that you can do. Now guys, I always like to, when I'm smoking, wrap my food towards the end, if it's, you know, if it's applicable, in a little bit of tin foil, because what that does is on the last bit of the smoking process, it takes those natural juices and it just redistributes them all around. So I'm gonna set that there. Now remember I talked about the, uh, the little handle, the pulley? Well, this is also used for when you want to combine the technology. So I got the grill on top, and underneath, I am smoking, guys. You know that place around the corner that, you know, only you and your buddy know about? Now you're going to be it. How about those ribs basting a brisket, basting a few chickens underneath? Are you kidding me with this? You're going to feed an absolute army, guys. So I'm going to set that right there. Gotcha. We're going to empty these baskets in just a second. And remember, these, these machines are designed to go with you. If you love tailgating, go ahead. Every, one of the, every store sells those little adapters. So instead of the 20-pound uh, propane tank, now you can do it with the little two-pounder. And you can go out there and you can, go, you can do your, uh, your uh, tailgating. Can you pass me those tongs, my brother? I can, buddy. Thank you. Now, look what we've got here, guys. We're going to have some fun oh. with this. The, get imaginative with your side. So many times with grills outside, you have almost no control over the temperature and the flare-ups and the fire. So doing dishes like bacon-wrapped broccolini and bacon, we like wrapping things in bacon, bacon-wrapped onions for a sandwich that I'm going to knock your sauce off with in a minute are much, much, much easier to do. I'm going to set that there. And by the way, you mentioned fruits, vegetables. Yeah. You know what? You do get tired of steamed fruit. You do get tired of steamed vegetables. So I'll tell you what. Every single time you put a fruit or a vegetable on a grill, those peaches? That, just do, yeah, that just does wow. something with the natural sugars, and it, 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 it makes it magic. If you don't like fruit, try grilling it. It'll be your that, favorite little sweet snack. The little snack. kiss of smoke on exactly. there just brings out all the flavor and all the sweetness. It's and amazing. That's so look at our layered. We're doing layered cooking here. Exactly. You're combining the technologies. Can you pass me the couple of cloths there? There we go. Cloths. Now, right underneath here and again think of the amount of food that we're fitting in here we've got our what's now got to be i mean world famous smoked mac and cheese i'm going to set that there yeah, that's for a, a special dish today in a second gotcha. and underneath that and then we're
we're going to go behind and we're going to start showing off this food. Look at this. I got a nice little surprise in the bottom there. A gorgeous pulled pork. Guys, you can do this. It's fast. It's simple. It's easy. All you're doing is turning one button. So, Guy, let me switch with you. All right, Let's buddy. Look at this food. And we've got our, we're going to leave our pork in there. We're going to pull that out in just a sec. But mm -hmm. we're going to start showing you the layers that we've done. Absolutely. Um, Mark's got a couple of racks of ribs over here that he's letting there. set. He's going to unload this smoker. What have you got on the first well, level, buddy? Well, that's a brisket right there. We're going to so let it rest for just a second. Nice brisket. Now, look at this, you guys. Every machine is going to come with two half racks. These are brilliant. This is gonna give you a way to custom configure your own basket. So if you wanna do multiple layers, you wanna do one large piece of food, you wanna do different foods on different levels, now you can absolutely do it. I'm gonna take our chickens here. Wow. These guys are gonna sit and wait for us just like that. And remember, it's all... Oh, oh my, look at the juice. <laughs> you see, can you show everybody juice, that? You guys. That's it's a ridiculous. What? You know what? So many times we say, if I have another piece of dry chicken, man, I'm going to kill somebody. My you gosh. will never, ever, ever have to experience dry chicken again. So let me set that there, and, and let's I, start with some food here. And by the way, you yeah. can... Remember, you can do this all yourself. Oh, I I, 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 tried, I started getting some of the bones out of Oof, there. It's so ridiculous. They fall out. It's so stupid. It's crazy. Yep. I like to say, there isn't a dog look at this. in the country that can get a bone this clean. Guys, look at this. It, this is incredible. This is crazy. You, out, you spend 15 20 25 30 dollars for that perfect rack of ribs you know what it's hit and miss half the time it, you, you know it's somebody in the back is just following a little a little uh, uh, you, you know corporate recipe this is your chance to do your thing at home your way have a great time with it take all those bones out like nothing and watch this yeah, you want a sandwich beautiful. Here, my friends, is a sandwich. That's one of the best pork sandwiches you will ever serve your friends and family. And it's not the all-day commitment. It's not all the knowledge that you need to have of smoking and barbecuing. All you need to know how to do from here on in, whether it's for you or for a gift, anybody you want to turn into a barbecue hero, turn one button, walk away. It's That's so, it. It's so simple, and, and it becomes very contagious. You're going to wind up using this several times in a week, because I'll tell you, the results are truly amazing. You get the crispy skin, you get that beautiful, juicy chicken on the inside, this whether you're seen. smoking, whether you're not, uh, you know, because you don't have to do it every time. You can you can just throw stuff in there when you just want to cook something for a couple hours. If you want to slow cook it, you can do that as well, but you get just the now, most tender This is what meat. we're all looking for. Do you see this around smoke, the ridge? Yeah. You see that smoke ring? It goes from pink to red, depending on how long you let it smoke. That's the flavor you can't duplicate. You can't do it with a spice, you can't do it with a sauce, you can't do it with a prayer, nothing. You gotta smoke the food, period. And charbroil gives you a way, in addition to roasting, in addition to grilling, in addition to big foods, small foods, mm -hmm. they're gonna give you a way, we're gonna give you a way to create all of these meals at home with virtually no effort. Now, this is the part that separates the men from the boys. It's the brisket. You talk about all the barbecue shows, Mm -hmm. Everything we see out there, how popular they are. It's an art form. This is what it comes yeah. down to, guys. People spend their whole lives trying to figure out how to master a brisket. We did it for you with the turn of a button. You see that fat cap? That's the first thing everybody looks for. Don't trim that fat off. It's the flavor. Because what happens, you guys, is as this browns and crisps and collects all of that flavor from the wood chips, it renders it into the meat below. So, guys, check this out. This is what you're lining up in the barbecue joint for. This is what you're hoping they get right. This is what they make shows out of. I'm telling you, watch this, watch this, watch this. And there's a true test to a good brisket. And all it is, watch this, is the tug. If it pulls apart like that with just a tug, you have one of the best briskets it's ever. It's beautiful. God, I got to try it. Yeah, this. don't burn yourself wow. now. Um, all it. right, so we are just scratching mm. the surface right here. If you'd like to get it, mm. we have 10 minutes left in the presentation. Again, it's $33.99. You get it home on, on FlexPay. Get it home for a fraction of the price. 80 bucks off our price, plus it's free shipping. Shipping is like 25 bucks, so you're gonna get that uh, uh, as well. You'll have this in a week. You can start eating and preparing what we're making in about a week. Beautiful. Labor Day's around the corner. You're gonna have sure. a great Labor Day party. But think about it, we love to cook during football season. There's nothing better than barbecue during football season. You got that and that's, right. And that's just starting. That's coming up in so the first game start in September. So if you wanna do that, college ball, hot dogs, hamburgers, we give you a grill top so you can grill on top of this in addition to that. The flavors are amazing, but really it's the, it's the family time. I think people love barbecue more, just as much, I should say, for the experience as That's they do for is. the food. That's what it is. Listen, I can slap a piece of chicken in a pan, I can put a pork chop in an oven, and it's fine, we're eating, it's food. But barbecuing, grilling, smoking, yeah. roasting in the backyard, that's about the experience. And not just the experience for you, but the experience for everybody. Bring them around, bring them together. Now switch mm. spots with me here. Hey, buddy. Okay, buddy. And I know we've got a little bit more food waiting on the grill over there, but while we're hanging out here, 
Let's have a look at this pork, you guys. You know, pulled pork, uh, it's, it's one of those things, I remember I, uh, I met my sweetheart on one of these, uh, you know, online dating mm -hmm. sites, and it was actually in there. If you don't know how to make or don't enjoy pulled pork, please move along. <laughs> I'm telling, telling you. you. Pulled pork is one of those dishes, boy. And we go out and we search it, we find it, we try and find the best spots for it, the secret wow. little hangouts, the secret little hideouts. You know what? I don't care how good of a pulled pork you've ever had your whole life, you're gonna make a better one in your own backyard. Now, there's my little tip. Guys, you see inside here, you see this Beautiful. juice? This is why you let the meat rest. Because what it does, and this is why you wrap it in the foil if you're smoking it in the last half hour or so. Because what it does is it takes all the juices that are redistributing throughout yeah. the pork, and instead of losing them in the grill below, yeah. now what you've Keeps got, it moist. watch this, is a beautiful, beautiful au jus that you can pour all over your steaks, mm -hmm. your chickens, your pulled pork. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this out of the way. And guys, watch this. By the way, these are the just handiest darn things ever if you're gonna go ahead and do any pulled pork, pulled beef, pulled this, pulled that, because watch this. All you do is just start pulling. Charbroil makes these as well. They're absolutely wonderful to have. It makes this part of it so much easier than trying to dig around with a fork. And guys, look at this steam. How beautiful is this? <laughs> and, uh, by the way, if you want to get those, they're only $9.95 and it. they're worth every penny because you don't have to touch the meat. It's always hard to pull pork by hand unless you're pa very patient. Most people aren't. So right. uh, do it like this. Okay. It makes life a lot easier. Oh, you easier. showed up at the right time. Oh, Hi, darling. Did, I was like, did somebody say pulled pork? <laughs> hey, uh, uh, where's, you know what? Do I need a fork? You can try this, but what, yeah, try it by itself so you can get a true taste of the pork. And you know, to Guy's point, you don't oh need to cover goodness. these with sauces and spices. Mm -hmm. The taste of the pork, especially oh a bone-in, is incredible. Oh. So next time you have a big party, mm. next time you have a bunch of people over, here's something I want you to try. Go mm -hmm. ahead and get those flats of buns. We've all seen them before. You can buy them sweet or just the regular. And you're gonna cut them right down the side, okay? So watch what I'm gonna do here. I've uh -huh. got my base. I'm gonna take my pulled pork. You're gonna love doing this, guys. It's fast, it's simple. It'll feed an army in no time at all. It's a great thing That's to feed the pork. kids with. Oh, no Watch doubt. what we're going to do here. Man. So we're going to spread that around just what like that. What else are you going to do, Mark? Okay. Mm. We're going to take You're gonna s uh, oh, bacon yeah. wrapped what? onions just like this. It's a little busy work right there to wrap that. an onion. But, you know, <laughs> a little bit of coleslaw. Well, I, think, I think he got Eric to sit there and, uh, and <laughs> wrap that. Okay, Look at that. One now. sandwich? No, 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 no. Watch okay. what we're going to do here. I'm going to set this on top and pass me a knife there if you could. And watch what I'm gonna do. Careful. Now you just wow. go ahead and you cut it right down the sections oh and gosh. you have as many perfect oh Look at tiny Whoa. little pulled pork bites that you could possibly come Got up with. So here, sliders right there. Exactly, look at this you guys. It's beautiful. That is a charbroil slider. When you do it, do it right or don't do it at all. Did you, you, did, did, you, did, you put any, did you put any mac and cheese on there by any chance? I forgot my mac what and cheese. What the heck? What is going on? <laughs> that know, is what, crazy. You want to jazz it up a little bit? I'm talking about the mac and cheese pork you know, slider. Wow, I'm so just so looking morning. at, I'm looking at the mac and cheese. I'm like, so why? I got so excited about the mm. onion. Why didn't he? I got so excited about the pork. So here, let me wow. add a little bit mm. of our smoked mac and cheese. Just like that. And now guys, look at this sandwich. Are you kidding me with this? That. That's crazy. Imagine that wow. at your next tailgating party, you guys. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> it is it. so good. If you look at everything so we've done here, by the way, I only have about five or six minutes mm. left. Wow. I, honestly, and, and, and Shannon knows this I'm as just... well. <laughs> It, you know, it's so much fun to do this stuff with your family. We were saying uh -huh. to Mark, you know, the experience of doing a barbecue is every bit as much fun as the food itself. Yeah. So it takes time, you know, there's not a rush. You know, hey, if you're in a hurry and you need to throw, slap a couple burgers on there and you got to feed the kids, you can do that as well because you just turn on all. the burner, you can do it. But what I love about it is, you know, that Sunday afternoon, the, the pregame stuff is on football, on TV, and the kids are running around, and you get that barbecue set up, and you, in the morning, maybe you put a brisket on there, and you know, by, by seven or eight o'clock at night, you're pulling that thing out, and it's unbelievable. Yeah. Just delicious stuff. It really is. It is really, really good. Is and good. it's so mm -hmm. easy to smoke, too, because smoking was actually, kind of, smoking is scary to me, smoking, smoking food, <laughs> yes. you know, kind of a little intimidating. You yeah. think it's so easy in the so charcoal? Simple. Uh, so simple. Yeah. I think it's one of the easiest one types button. of cooking because it's relatively forgiving. When you're slow yeah. cooking, 
you're not cooking, when you slow cook, you're not really looking for rare food. You're looking for stuff that's cooked that's gonna yeah. tenderize. It's usually tougher cuts of meat that are more affordable, but that take forever to cook. Exactly. So you just slow cook them and then they get more tender and they usually have more fat too. Yeah. So, uh, you know, that gives you flavor. Fat is mm. flavor at the end of the day. So mm. it really, you, you just, you can't go wrong. It's mm. a lot of fun. Um, where's, I wanna grab my cookbook again one more time. Yeah. Here it is. Oh, yeah. Then we'll Talk kind of show everybody. We still have some more food in the grill too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you wanna grab this cookbook and have you seen this what's inside here it's beautiful it, there, it's so inspiring there are so many different it's all color-coded inside when you open it up the little table of contents but I'm gonna open it up the mm. pictures then we'll just come to some stuff and the things that you can make I mean that, look at you can do pizza and by the way pizza's on the grill amazing because you get oh, that smoky pizza flavor the incredible <gasps> there's some of the stuff Mark was doing Mm. Some of the sandwiches. Um, the, there's vegetable dishes in here as well. So if you're not a meat eater, don't worry. You can have corn. <laughs> there's always it. corn. There's always corn. You know what? You know what Corn's so with good, though. Wait, it's so good. On I, the grill? I was just in Vermont. And there's corn season up there. Uh-huh. <laughs> Bro, let me tell you, you can run out. No, you can just run out in the field and eat that stuff off the well, stock. It's you, that you know, good. But when you, put, when you do it on a grill, because we grilled it, <clears throat> and here's a little tr trick I'll tell you. Um, mm -hmm. Shuck your corn. I like to do that first, get all the stuff off. You don't have to, but I did it. You take um, salt and pepper and butter and you, you put that on where the, cones, where the corn is cold, wrap it in foil and put it on the grill and just leave it on the grill for like 10 minutes and it comes out and it caramelizes. Oh my gosh. It is ridiculous. That's like that's like dessert and dinner. It was all high time, but, but, right there, but right? you need a grill to do that. You can't you know, do that. You know just the best regular. part is being able to take the ideas like that, the recipes like that, the things that you see online, your own imagination, whatever, and share with friends. So here's what I'd love to do: just give everybody a quick reminder of God, everything Mark. that we just saw. And I still have some more food on the grill waiting to show you, too. And you can see here how fast the machine is, how simple it is to use. And, guys, the sheer variety of food, from pulled pork to your incredible vegetable side dishes, smoked mac and cheese, brisket that is going to win, you know, your, your, your backyard championship for sure. Look at the bark on that. I can't even tell you how good that tastes. No effort at all. Guys, chickens, turkeys anything like that is going to be absolutely fork tender the second it comes out of the machine. You don't even need a knife. You don't got a saw. You don't need to cut. It's just going to melt in your mouth. Ribs, unlike anything you've ever made. I'm going to cut one right down here because I want you to see this, okay? Look at that. There's your smoke ring. Again, you can't fake that. You can't uh, do it with a sauce. You can't do it with a spice. The only way you can do it is with a smoker. And we're giving you that option with your three-in-one. Have a look here, guys. Don't forget the capacity. You can fit so much food in that basket. 25, 30, 35, 40 pounds worth of the best low boil you've ever had. And don't forget, not only is it a roaster, not only is it a smoker, not only is it going to feed one person or 100, but guys, look at this all of your grilled mm. food. Oh. You know, most of the time, we're gonna go out and we're gonna have a steak. We're gonna go out and we're gonna have a pork chop. We're gonna go out and we're gonna have a piece yeah. of salmon. Well, this is one of the fastest, easiest grills you're ever gonna use in your life, period. And all 184 square inches are infrared. And your fruits and vegetables, remember what I said before? The second fruits and vegetables hit a grill, Something magic happens because of the natural sugars, the caramelized fats, everything that goes on in there. So you're still getting that incredibly healthy food, that mm -hmm. incredibly healthy dish, but it's not steamed. It doesn't have a little bit of salt and pepper. You didn't put it in a microwave. Mm -hmm. Nope, you actually grilled it. And guys, you gotta see this. Here's my little tip for you. Go ahead, if you're an avocado fan, you wanna add a little bit of a healthy zing to your dishes, do your avocado on a grill, and then the skin, watch this, pops right off. We did this last night, and then all you do, guys, oh. this you can add as a topper to your chicken, to your pork chops, uh, yeah. anything oh, you man. want. So now watch what I'm gonna do. Now Just you've got it. the creaminess of the avocado with the incredible juiciness mm. of a perfectly grilled pork chop. Man, I'm telling you, life doesn't get much better than this. You don't have wow. to be a grill master. You don't need some degree in grillology. All you need to know no. how to do is turn on the gas, and click the igniter, you're done. We've taken care of everything else. And I'll switch with Shannon here just real quick. Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to head out because oh, i got to go back God. to home base, but I'm going to take this and go. It's delicious, yeah. would, that turkey. Would, would you incredible. like a bacon wrap? Give my book back. Grilled cheese sticker. sandwich? <laughs> she took the book, too. <laughs> She's like, I'll just be back. I'll take the book. She just ran guys, out with the book. Let me finish where it all started for us, you guys. It's Look at all this turkey. about You know, you results. see Shannon and us were just hacking it up. We're like, oh, my God, this is so good. I know. It's like this, this was like one slice out of it when I left. If you bought this just for, hey, listen. 
listen, and you know this, if you bought this just for Thanksgiving, it would right. pay for itself, guys, because exactly. think about it. You don't want to screw up a turkey on Thanksgiving. You don't want to, and listen, I'm not telling you don't buy a deep fryer. What I'm telling you is if you buy that, prepare to spend $50 on the oil, then yep. throw the oil away and use it probably once a year. Exactly. You can't barbecue in a deep fryer. This you will use, and you get that deep fried flavor. Exactly. It, it really is the same flavor. It really is the same flavor. <coughs> and guys, Excuse there's me. a reason for it. It's that true infrared cooking technology that only Charbroil brings you. This is the only place you're going to get it. Every other place that I've ever seen infrared, it's in a tiny little box off in a corner, right. and you kind of shove a steak in front of it to see if you can char it up. This is a full functioning infrared roaster smoker grill there's no flares to worry about there's no fire to worry about there's no hairdo like mine unless it's on purpose you have to worry about and that's what scares people away from backyard grilling everybody can use this you guys absolutely everybody from what you saw today from the brisket to the pork to the chicken to the the turkey to the bacon wrapped grilled cheese yeah. Turn a button, turn on the igniter, and be that backyard barbecue hero. There's, listen, and I love that, say, a bar bar barbecue hero, because that's what it is. And people will love it. Uh, hey, listen, if you don't have a lot of friends, get one of these, and I'll tell you. It's, you're <laughs> They'll gonna, show you're, up. You're going to show up. They're going to all show up, because people crowd to the barbecue, just, so they, just like they do to the funniest guy in the room. You're going to love this at $169.95. Mark's coming back a little bit later on mm. today. Uh, you have another presentation of our grill. Hopefully you'll be outdoors. You can get to enjoy it outside mm. as well. Uh, Mark, thank you, my friend. Thank you. Um, this is also one of our 10 faves. You know, you love this uh, as much as we do. Uh, and if you want to check it out or any of the other uh, 10 faves that we have there in our uh, selection, you just go to hsn.com for a little pink flag, uh, and you'll know that those are indeed one of our 10 favorite items, and you're going to love it. Hey, listen, if you want to...